the respect with the clicks was good game and this is a part two i felt like since y'all here i want you to meet ariana you know what i'm saying get to know her and see her you know what i'm saying so as you know this is her and we're going to blah 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 i'm gonna tell you blah 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 this and that so let's do it yo ari Okay, so I'm currently doing a YouTube channel right now. I, I'm, 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 I'm live right now. So they looking at you right now. They see you. So wave hi to the camera. Wave hi to the camera. They already, they already saw you. So it makes no sense to cover your face now. Anyways, I need, I need some questions for you for my YouTube channel. Look at the camera. Look at the camera. I need some things for my YouTube channel. Oh, wait, let me. Oh. Okay, so number one. How do you think high school is going for you so far in the school? Chaotic. And why is it chaotic? And what do you mean by something going on? Always arguing with Brandon. Oh, I mean that's that's natural. Number two, how do you feel about me and the gang, like the group? You um. Don't don't do that. Don't do that. Come on, be be serious. Be for real. Okay. We vibe. We vibe. You know, you cool. You care. You could get me mad. Of course, I always have to get you mad. That's what I do. I don't know how I get you sad. I just be me and then you just be sad for no reason, bro. <laughs> and yeah, with the game, with the game, you know, um, I love those kids, but sometimes they could be annoying and I want them to get out of my face. But other than that, you're a capper. Anyways, last one. Um,. What you call it? Do you think that um, you could picture your life like as like you know junior and senior in this school? And if so, why? I could picture my junior year in the school and my senior year because like you know I love I like the school. It's cute. As it's chill, you know. Uh, I I go to school with a lot of people that I went to middle school with, so it was like a gang. Oh, yeah. Fun fact: Me and Ariana actually knew each other in Madiba. Ooh, scary. Yeah, I knew her since sixth grade, six, seven, and only six and seventh grade. But then when eighth grade and ninth grade came, she went to a different school, and I was in um. Madiba still, and then I transferred to this school, and then junior year, sophomore year, she came back to the school, blah, 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 and yeah, she's just black, so, and don't let her, don't let her looks fool you, she is not innocent, she's not who you think she is, and you could say it for me, because trust me, I ain't gonna spread no detail, but, <laughs> don't, don't let it fool you, don't let it fool you, look at this face, Look at the bun. Look at the bun. Getting it from me. Don't. 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 Anyways, thank you for your time, Ariana. I'm gonna get back to this vlog. You know what I'm saying? Um, I I love you. Love you too. Okay. I so back and um the thing. You know what I'm saying? Anyways. Yeah, I'm pretty I'm pretty happy. Not too happy because I have to get over the past and 
sometimes getting over the past is hard, like really, really hard. But you just gotta do it. Like you can't go back in time and fix anything. You just gotta live with it, cause it's like if you go back in time and fix it, it's like I don't know. It's like I would never like if I had the power to go back in time. I think I wouldn't, because I feel like I would mess up certain parts of my life. Like just like the smallest mistakes you could change will change your whole path completely. And I don't want to do that. I'm happy the way I'm living. I'm happy how my life is turning out. But at the same time, my past is holding holding me back, I would say. But the thing is, we all have to move on. Like, people have to move on. Friends got to move on sooner or later. Some of my friends won't probably won't, not go to college. They'll try to achieve their dreams. Blah, blah, blah. But you see me. I'm trying to get the whole gang together and try to go to the same college. You know what I'm saying? So we could all stay intact. We both study the same things or we could study mostly the same things. We hang out after school. That's how I want it to be. You know what I'm saying? I just want the whole gang to stay together because out of all my friends, groups I've had in my life, like from Madiba, from anywhere, I think that this group is the most efficient group I've ever been in. Like... They make things so much fun, and they're just unpredictable, which makes it so much fun for me. Because I don't want to be knowing what you're going to do. Like, I want you to, like, make me wonder, make me curious. You know what I'm saying? But for the freshmen out there, I'm going to give you all an update. Like I said in my part one, I'm going to give you all an update on how high school is. Sophomore year, the best thing. It's way better than freshman year. I could tell you that much. I feel like my class is more stable than it was in my freshman year because in my freshman year, we had like two fights in my classroom. And the thing is, those were the only fights that happened in the school, like in freshman year. It was always in our classroom because we were always the ones starting drama and trouble and it's yeah. Ugh. But sophomore year, I have classmates I know, like a lot of my classmates I know, like and it's like I could deal with it I could really deal with it like even though I'm separated from all my close ones even people I like to talk to like for example I really like to talk to Layla because she's so chill like and I get Layla like she's like one of the most chillest girls I know like without talk like we don't talk that much but when I talk to her I could really genuinely have a conversation with her like she's chill to Leah she's also chill I like her personality she's pretty nice she's pretty chill and she always like it's a funny person, uh, like, in general. Um, Medina, one of my old friends, she moved to a different school. She was one of the best, one of the most chillest people I know, too. Like, she never did too much. And she was always, like, confident in her abilities. And that's what I really liked about Medina. And um, how else I know? Luigi. 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 Luigi, she was a nice person, too. I mean, yeah, she did some stuff. Like, not bad stuff, but she just did some stuff. And I can respect her for that. It's Luigi. She, she's her own person, and I respect Luigi as a person, too. Um, honestly, in general, Luigi's a really dedicated and confident person. And I'm really glad that she's going to achieve her dreams as a nurse or a doctor. And I really hope it goes far. Um, what else girls do I know in my school? Ooh, the Spanish kids. So, Sophia, she's in my class. I knew her since freshman year. They had a language barrier between the class, so most of the classmates won't talk to her in freshman year. So, I wanted to talk to them, you know, get them, you know, like, like even though they had each other, I just like the connections they had with each other because of the barrier. Like, they actually could understand because they all know Spanish, the Spanish kids. But, like, they cancel out everyone around them, which is kind of... A good thing like they don't care about anything they don't care about drama they just do what they gotta do and that's what I respect so I started talking to them and they're really cool like even though I have I understand zero the things they're saying most of the time when when we when I like be like ching chong monaka shiniki it's like they be like huh 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 and it's like I'd be laughing and me and my friends be laughing like I'm not trying to be like uh like you know a racist person be like oh I'm making fun of the language it's just how we joke around you know what I'm saying like they know I'm joking and they play along with this, so it's like all cool, you know, all jokes. Um, 
and um who else i know um jennifer now jennifer she's really cool like jennifer she's chill like she she's really cool like she's chill chill like we had a science project with her once and she was she was doing we was like me it was me angel and some other guy me oh me angel and isaac i think and it was um sophia um edison and jennifer and we was competing like me and her like me and sophia i was like yeah i'm gonna win you know she gave me the middle the middle finger at me and i'm like oh oh and because i won and i was like yeah sophia how you feel how what you gotta say about that she just said middle finger and i'm like oh my god and i'm like jesus christ like why so toxic why so toxic sophia why so toxic and then she like oh she like she was just like "Mm -mm," speaking spanish and i had no idea what she was saying for real but they cool i really like those spanish kids like i i would love them in my like like again like i I would like them in our class like all three of them because Sophia is the only one in the like from the Spanish kids that's in my class. Edison and Jennifer, I don't know if they're in the same class. I don't because last year the only reason why they were in my class, like the Sophia, Edison, and Jennifer, was because they came in kind of late. Like they weren't like here first year. Like they kind of came earlier, and then before Sophia came. First, it was Edison and Jennifer. One day, I think we was in Mr. Bergenham's class, aka Mr. B, for health, physical, um, physical health, like not health, like P, like PE, like just health. And we were sitting in the class. They came in the classroom. They sat in like the first two seats in the top corner, like you know, like the back, like the back, like back corner, all the way to the front. Yeah, they were like in the front corner, like front left corner. And I was like sitting right next to them, next to my friend Nayo. And then after like a few months, next year, 2022, that's when Sophia came. And that's when they started talking. And then blah, 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 yada, yada, yada. Yeah. Stuff like that. But yeah. Uh, like I said, sophomore year, like once you're a sophomore, it's like you get the concept. And you're like, you're like when you're like a eighth grader going into like high school, it's like, you're like, oh my God, this and that. What am I going to do? Like. I don't know, like, I'm doing this, what if I do something wrong, don't worry about all that, man, like, just be you, man, that's what I did, man, look where it got me, I got so many friends, I can't even count, I got friends outside of school, inside of school, I see them by my block, I just have a lot of friends, like, anywhere I go, you know, I'm just, I'm just talking to people, like, but sometimes I like to be alone, like, sometimes I don't talk to no one for the, for the whole day. Because sometimes I just like to be thinking, doing what I got to do without talking to people. And then I be locked in, locked in for real, um, and stuff. And, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, because what I'm telling you, I, when I'm locked in, I'm locked in. Like, I don't focus on anything around me other than what I'm doing. So, like, if I'm thinking, I don't pay attention to nobody. I don't pay attention to class and stuff. But, honestly, Wednesday is going to be a really good day for me. That's why I'm actually going. I could honestly choose not to come for the whole entire week if I really want to, like, this week. But I I feel like I should just for the gang because because everybody says that, oh, without me, the gang, like, everything is just, like, not fun, and I'm like, okay, you know what I'm saying, like, I think it's fun when you, with, like, when I'm not around, but people say, like, oh, it's, it's not fun when you're around, you bring the, you bring the comedy and the, and the joy into this, because every time, like, after school, we all, like, this is what I like about the gang, so even though we're separated every single day, before we go home, we go to the park. We leave school at one forty-six, and we just play basketball or we go get pizza. It could be on Quentin, it could be on me, it could be on Nayo. It's mostly either Nayo or Quentin. Um, but yeah, but we be we OD be like, you know what I'm saying? Like we OD be going to play basketball, and then we got the basketball team jo- joining. We we get three v threes, but like we OD be like playing around type. Shit. And it's like, I can respect that. And, yeah. Just know, I'm really happy on how things turned out. I'm really happy. Um, But at the same time, I'm not. Because if I could change the past right now, I think I would. Just by slight things that I did. 
like slight things that I said and did, but it's in the past now. I can't go back. I can't talk to them. I can't do this. I can't do that. We just gotta move on. You know what I'm saying? But 36 back with the clicks. This is the finale of the update. I'll probably try to make a video soon, but if not, I'll probably see you in the next month or so. Um, I know it seems kind of long, but because the last video I made was that what rating chicken. Rating fry, rating Chick Fil A chicken sauces. I don't know. I remember Angel was the recorder. Shout out to my boy Angel. You know what I'm saying? Angel Cruz, my boy right there. You know what I'm saying? Angels from the heavens. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'll probably see y'all in the next month. Um, if not, I'll see y'all next week or so. Get a new update, tell y'all what's been going on, and I'll see y'all in the next video. DB Nation, we out.